Hey everybody, Chris Farad here. Welcome back to Enemy Within. After much deliberation, I've decided I'm doing this. Taking out all these rookies. Oh my god, what am I doing? This could be a terrible idea. I probably should have taken at least our sniper out. Oh yeah, but she's hurt. on the mission sites. Listen up. Oh, We're going man. to be dropping you deep in the Nigerian interior for the next operation. Meld canisters, UFOs crimson in justice. A densely populated urban area. Okay, pinks. Be safe. Come in, HQ. Big Sky has reached the outer marker. Approaching the crash site now. Strike team is awaiting your orders. Affirmative, Big Sky. Strike one is free to engage hostile targets at the crash site. Can we get a meld sneak peek? Doesn't appear to be the case. Baron Betzer. I'm on the move. Welcome to the squad. Beagle, let's get you in behind him. And you know what? Everybody just up there. I'm on a commander. We don't need to commit I'm to a location move. yet because we don't know where anything is. I'm covering that down here. Oh, oh, Alright. We're not heading in the wrong direction. That's one way to look at it. I'll tell you what, Shang. You I head in moving. there. Weapons Scope hot. things out. Oh god. I do not like that very much. So they stealth and then they move. Uh, that causes some concern. Let's put Beagle coming. in there with Zhang. Uh, fields Position take confirmed. full cover over here. We're kind of now at the mercy okay. of these frickin' Seekers, but hopefully uh, come out of this okay. And then Baron Bateser over here is now. fine. The trouble is if two of them are going to show up at one time, which will probably happen. There's one. Oh my god. Destroyed. Imagine if we would have missed that. But the other one's probably going to show now, and we have no overwatches left. Oh, he's going to sh- Oh! Oh! He's going to shoot somebody. Enemy is still alive. I always forget that they can shoot, too. Ooh. Hello. Oh, there it is, right there. But we also had one coming from this direction, I thought. Oh, it's right there. Okay. Let's keep it together here. Hitting these things is goddamn difficult. Well, we can. Beagle, how you feeling about yes, going up there? Pretty good, I guess. I didn't think twice about it. Still not a better shot, really. But that was pretty magnificent. Uh, who else could we put up there? We could put Jang up there. That's affirmative. Fifty-eight. Come on. There it is. That alien is no longer a threat. <laughs> That's true with Shang. Good work. On my way. Make our way towards this meld. While simultaneously making our way towards the other meld. I'm on it, Commander. Okay. 
Now, Fields, you should be able to grab this. I'm hoping you're close enough. Perfect. Solid copy. That's what we're looking for. Hostile spot. Ah, God, I knew we'd find him soon. Well, the good news is we have rockets, so. Got the goods. Got the meld. Um, Zhang is a little far away. Okay, I can kill him, so that's a plus. What I would like to do is at least try to kill him with other guys. Specifically the rookies. Get them some action here. Um, On the move. There's super low chances. Adjusting sights. It's worth a shot. I don't even really want to shoot him with. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna collateral damage him so we have better shots of hitting him. For See if Cast can hit him. Come on, buddy. Oh, a little off. Ah, did it more. Little off. Beagle, do you think I'm you rolling. can do it? Come on, brother. Come on, brother. Oh, Jesus Christ. Adjusting sights. Alright, well, let's use the shredder then. There won't be anything left. Okay. I had a feeling that wasn't going to be it. Because that would have been very quick. And usually, once you find him, like, that's the end, so... We know there's another meld canister over here. So we'll make our way towards that. I'm just going to check things out with green. Okay, three turns to get to that. It's plenty of time, I think. Roger that. Ready to engage. Of everybody stack in here. Position confirmed. Zhang, you too. Actually, you know what? On task. You hang back. You reload. Everyone's gonna reload if necessary. Ready to engage. off. We're green to go. Reloading. That's actually preferable. Got it. Because we know the outsider is not in there, um, this makes this attempt a bit safer. But you never, you never know. That's the trouble. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna put fields. Oh, I'm gonna have to move someone out of the way. Will do. Let's put fields up by. You know what? I'm gonna get more people out of the way so you have a clearer target. We know that the enemy's that way. So fields, um, I'm dashing you in here, okay? I guess I don't really need to dash. I'm doing it. So we can grab it next turn. But I, I don't like dashing right to it because you never know if you're going to be in trouble or not. And I just figure it's safer to be able to dash there and then run away if we need to. Running. Now come and grab this meld. Roger that. Got it. Doink. And 
and I kind of want to just hold off until we get her back in the mix here. I love the languages. The alien flight computer could prove to be extremely useful in our own research. Please take great care in returning it to the base in one piece. Val, I've already got like, I already got two of them. I've sold a bunch under your nose. You should be paying attention. You do. You're clearly not. Okay, rookies, in line. Uh, Zhang, I want you in a position where you can save our asses if necessary. This looks like a good position for that. Position confirmed. Position confirmed. I have more commander. I have more meld than I know what to do with right now because I my gene lab or my genetics lab just isn't finishing. It's taking forever. Oh, there we go. Oh, thin men too, you little. Nice. They are positioning to flank us. Yeah, they sure are, aren't they? He's not overwatched, is he? I I don't think he is. And I can collateral damage now because of the upgrade that we picked. So it uses like a giant chunk, but it doesn't use all of it now, which is that's a big advantage. Uh, so I'm gonna use this. Because I would really love to see some of these rookies get these kills. Um, I don't think... I don't think he's on Overwatch. Oh god, I'm nervous. Got it. No. Okay, good. Come on, rookie. Damn it. Negative damage. It's one rookie failure right there. Let's try that again. Beagle. I know what you want to do. I know you want to flashbang. So hold on then. I know you want to flashbang. So let's see if somebody else can do this. Oh my god! Just die already! I have Zhang's rocket, but it's like, I really don't want to have to use it. Beagle, I'm doing this for you, man. I know you want to do this, and it's not, it's so useless. But I know you just want to flashbang. There it is. Be happy about it. <laughs> Nobody's gonna understand what I'm talking about. But, uh, you know what? For you, man. <laughs> If we don't get the okay. kill, I'll, I will just blow a rocket at his face. I'm okay with it. Oh, we can't even see that. Really? All right. Jang to the rescue. Firing rocket. Commander, it would be preferable if we attempted to retrieve those canisters rather than destroying them. Okay. Well, this batch of rookies is uh is uh. Well, let's just say that there's some skill to be desired. Um, it'll come with time. I have faith. It looks like they're really taking care of business down there. And yep. without so much as a scratch. Yeah, they are. Yeah, they are. Okay, Shang, good job. Captain. Uh, ooh, another, this is again a tough call. Again a tough call. We already have Danger Zone with one of our heavies. So for some versatility. You know what? More explosives for Zhang, the better. That's what I always say. We did get a lot of stuff out of that. 
Some flight computers. One's damaged. That's fine. Damaged UFO power source. We have medals available fine. in the barracks, Commander. If you feel any soldiers merit an award. I do? Did I just get this? Or did I? Oh, you know what? I got it last time and I didn't give it to anybody. Uh, this is the one that gives the plus two will per different nationality in the squad. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to award this to our highest... Uh, highest ranked trooper because there's an ability in the officer training school that replaces all of the other people's will with the captain's will or with the uh, squad leader's will so i'm gonna give this to zhang could go to either one but because zhang doesn't have one and he did win us that mission last time so eventually his will hopefully if he's the the leader he will replace all of the others uh, will with his own, which is cool. That's a really cool upgrade. Uh, let's see here. Can we get to the end of this month already? Like, I really need to launch some satellites. And I can't really afford anybody else causing me grief here. Um, we got a few things to sell. I mean, we have lots of Thin Men corpses and lots of Sectoid corpses that we could sell now. These Thin Men are really making us some money. Uh, is there anything that we absolutely need to build right now? Not exactly. I'm gonna need... Uh, I'm gonna need a satellite uplink. There's no question. So I could sell a bunch of stuff to get one of those. Oh, but I don't have the power, which I want to get here. Thermo generator we need 200 credits for. So why don't we save for that? We'll get the thermo generator. That's going to put us in a great spot. And then, uh, yeah, let's do that. Come on, genetics lab. Thank you. Now I can launch satellites. That was a good month, I think. This is so cool. I can't wait to use this. I cannot wait to use that. That's going to be so cool. All right, here we go. We are taking... Um, now, this is this is going to... Mm, this really hurts me to do this. I would like to just take Argentina and Brazil because then there's so many autopsies that we can just blow through. But I, I really need to keep every country. So I think I'm just going to take all the ones with the panic. And call it a day. And then we can get Argentina pretty easily next month. And we'll even launch an early satellite next month. so that we, Just so we can get all the free autopsies. Uh, so let's go to We've been China. Up some odd transmissions lately. Some nut calling himself Commander Straker has been all over the news ranting about shadow operatives. This gets us another satellite or another uh, scientist per month as well. Satellite launched. We will need to station interceptors here, though, so we have to do that like now. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. All right. So that saves all the countries from leaving. Uh, before we go, though, uh, so we're now in South America and Asia. So either way, I think transferring takes the same amount of time, does it not? Yeah, three days. It takes the same amount of time as building one. South America, let's go. You know what, let's transfer you one as well. And then let's order another one for North America. I'm almost wondering though, I should wait till the beginning of the month to order these so that I don't incur the cost. Like, I'm going to have to pay that 20 bucks probably right at the end of the month. And then, again, next month. So, I'm going to hold off on that. Now, thermonuclear, though, I kind of want to just get going, like, now. 
So what I could do is sell a whole bunch of these guys. Uh, is that 70? So 130. That's 150. You can sell some floater corpses. And what else? Illyrium. I won't sell that because people get really upset when I sell Illyrium. Even though I usually end up with excess Illyrium. And what I do wind up being short on is like weapon fragments late game. So I could probably get rid of some Seeker Racks because I'm not sure exactly what they do yet. Maybe that's a reason not to sell them. And I'd rather sell less Sectoids and more Thin Men because those are more readily available. Floaters as well, we find a lot of. Negative. That equipment should be passed on directly to the research team. You just need to chill your balls, Bradford. That's what's up. Thermo generator. Boom. 20 power. I'm okay with this. And then, you know what? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to get another batch of money here. Even though the council reports in two days, I'm okay doing this. Because, uh... The more the merrier, I think. Get a laboratory, it's... Oh, you know what? That is pretty expensive. Damn it. No, I'm not going to do that. It's... I thought it was a lot cheaper. I could have got some awesome training school upgrades too, but I can get that with the new uh, money in the month. We're getting 504 a month. That's pretty good. So, uh, hopefully we get to the end of the month here. Incoming transmission. We are extremely impressed with the progress of the XCOM project thus far, Commander. Your recent results were beyond our expectations. And that is not a statement this council makes lightly. I'm actually really happy with the way this is going. Um, we've built up our squad pretty well. Things were very tight early on. Um, and things have gone pretty well. We lost two, two places in the first uh, month. Which on Impossible is like... I mean, it's almost impossible not to ha lose a place. But uh, pretty good so far. Remember, and I don't want to get too confident. We will be watching. So now we have money, okay? That's good. The new engineers arrived this morning, Commander. We're always glad to have more help down here. So we have 24 engineers. How's our research doing? I appreciate doing? your oh, efforts five to days. support the research team, Commander. I've already put the new recruits to work in the lab. I think we could still use more scientists, though. I Commander, really do. The genetics lab is now prepped and fully staffed. We can begin genetic modification of our soldiers on your order. Yeah, Commander, that's true. The genetics lab is now prepped and okay. fully stopped. We can begin genetic modification of our soldiers on your order. This okay. facility will be the nerve center of our genetic modification program. Our soldiers will receive entirely new capabilities, making them more effective on the battlefield than ever before. As we improve our understanding of alien genetics, the range of available modifications will expand. The only the thing is, I don't know. Substance has been enormously valuable in advancing our theories on genetic modification. So far, we've been limited to the augmentation of existing human organs. With the latest autopsy results, we now have the option of incorporating alien physiology into our genetic enhancement programs. It may be asking too much of our soldiers. They will be even more capable on the battlefield. So the thing is, I don't even know really what's available. Um, I guess we'll throw Carla in there. Oh, we can actually just do things right now. Okay, that's cool. Oh, this is cool. Okay. <laughs> oh, look at the meld cost isn't that bad. Oh, that's a little bit more. Solar regenerates two HP per turn. How can I not? Uh, but we don't know what the other option is. And this is where all the autopsies come into play. Height advantage confers additional 5 aim. Mm. I like this one. Let's do that. Oh, it takes her 3 days too. Jeez. 
So maybe I should choose both. Adaptive bone marrow is pretty good. I don't know what that would have to be, but that's it's probably something to do with like jumping. I'm gonna do both. Oh, and it just oh, okay, so it stacks anyways. It's not that big of a deal. I like that though, the rapid and it and it stacks with rapid recovery, so. You know what? Carla. I have get the in selected there. volunteer sent to surgical prep immediately. Once the genetic modification is complete, I will notify you directly. Who else could we throw in there? It'd be cool to have an assault with some crazy stuff. Oh, but it's the same things. Right, that makes sense, obviously. I'm gonna wait until we get all our autopsies done. But I like that one so far. That's cool. I really I really do like that. It might be good to have the assault uh, have that one as well, but I typically use the assault as kind of like a finisher. I don't really run them up there to uh, be in the heat of the battle as much, so let's just leave her in there for now. Uh, what else? Let's visit the officer training school and get, uh, well, pretty much everything. I don't really care about iron will. I'll buy that if I have the extra cash. Um, I do care about rapid recovery. So that's happening. And this is probably a good one just to grab. It's only 50 credits. Just so that people don't panic. I'm just going to grab that and hope that I don't have to worry about that anymore. Uh, what else, though? There's a bunch of things going on. Build or upgrade the mech. I could build a new mech. I could build more satellites. I have two coming. I need... How many more here? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven in total. Plus the two that I'm going to get. So... I'm still in satellite construction mode. I do also need to build a... Uh, an arc thrower... What is that building called? The a oh, the alien containment prior... Yeah, so... This is important, but we need the power. So, I can't do anything until this this is finished, except... Yeah, because this is five power. Except for build a laboratory. So, I'm going to do that. I've never done this in the past. I've never built a single laboratory ever. But I'm going to do it. Because scientists and research speed right now could be the difference between life and death. So, let's get this up and running. And it's got the adjacency bonus to the genetics lab. Thermal generator in seven days. Where would that put us? Oh yeah, that would be fine. We could still get an uplink done. And that uplink, because it will have the adjacency bonus, will give us an extra three. Satellite uplink facilities at maximum capacity. Additional uplink required. Which means I should probably... Where is it here? We're getting two more satellites. So I should probably get one more satellite going also. Commander, Let's do it. Our current satellite uplink facilities are at full capacity. We should build additional uplinks as soon as possible to allow for new satellite deployments. And what else? What else do we want to use here? I think we're pretty much set. I mean, I could throw people in here, but... Uh, until I know what my options are, I'm a bit limited. I'm throwing Carla in there because it's I want to see what happens. You know, and I think that she's going to really benefit from it. Um, oh, yeah. What I was going to do is order more of these. So that's, that's how we'll finish this up. Uh, let's grab one here. And... Let's just make a little bit more money. God, I hate selling stuff, but... I like to have backup. And I don't know... I mean, I don't know where they're going to shoot at us next. It could be anywhere. <laughs> Let's, uh... Where do we not want them going crazy? 
We're going to save South America, so that's fine. Let's put this in Asia. Oh, but we already lost one in Asia. So let's not do that. We don't have any satellites in Europe. You know what? Oh, no, we have one there, too. I guess it doesn't really matter. Let's just put it in Asia. Okay, decided. All right, here we go. Oh my god. Oh my god, beam weapons. Sick. Laser pistols, laser rifles, and I don't have any money. <laughs> Jesus. So cool. All right. Well, that's a big deal. It really is. Uh, what do we want next? Don't we have a power source? Oh, the one we got was damaged. That's right. All these autopsies, hey? I know I should go for the arc thrower, but, but, I think I'm actually going to go for the nav computer because we're going to need these to take down some of the UFOs if we don't have the strongest UFOs. So I'm going to do that instead. And hopefully, when this finishes building, we'll be in a position to uh, to have that done even faster. And then we're going to need money for our satellite uplinks and all that kind of stuff. So, a little bit alien. We are on the threshold of a new kind of warfare. Our soldiers were already humanity's best warriors. Now, as we learn from our fallen enemies, we can make their strengths our own. Make us proud, Boom Boom. Make us proud. That is so cool. Let's go take a look at her. So now she has to show her arms, right? Is that is that the deal? Oh, we have all sorts of different things here. Oh, I see what's up. Okay, well that'll work, I guess. Boom, boom. <laughs> so good. Hyperactive pupils, adaptive bone marrow. So she's going to be in the front lines, I think. That's cool. Thermogenerator, one day. Commander. Oh, we're all detecting right. a new contact. Much larger than anything we've previously encountered. I recommend we scramble our best equipped uh, fighters if we're going to engage that ship. See, that's the problem. I bet you this thing is going to get shot down. That's going to be a big problem. At we're least it has pursuit. Phoenix cannons, but we have nothing to like do anything against it. Nearing strike oh, range. Gosh. You need to start firing. Oh, I had to abort. I had to. There's nothing I could do. Contact detected. Yeah, there's nothing I could do. That's going to cause some issues. Thermogenerator online. Okay, thermogenerator's done. Uh, which means I really need to get an uplink now. It's already getting kind of late in the month here. So I don't know how much I can rely on waiting around for things. Um... But I I don't know if I can sell 150 credits worth of things unless I sell some Illyrium, which I th I honestly think is what I should do. Let's sell some Seeker Rex. We'll find lots of those. We'll find lots of these. We'll find lots of these. We'll find a few of these. It's still not very much. We're doing it. Difficult decisions have to be made. Oh, 
Oh, it's only a hundred. Well, good to know. Okay. Oh, now what we could do with that money is we could buy some laser rifles. And you can be damn sure we're going to be buying a bunch of them. I'm going to sell even one more thing. No, I better not sell that. Let's sell some alloys. We'll get three rifles. These are crucial. This is going to help us a lot. We have a secure transmission coming in from the council, Commander. Just panic reduction. Hey, I'm okay with that. Our sources reported develop. Oh, God. I've heard rumors about this. <laughs> Our sources reported developing incident in Newfoundland. Up the coast from St. John's. A fishing village has gone dark. Reports from intel sources suggest alien involvement. We should send in a team to investigate the site and figure out what happened. We're going to Newfoundland. We are confident that you will handle this matter with discretion. Yeah. This is... I hear that this is miserable. So... We're bringing in Boom Boom for sure. Let's go scope. We're bringing fields because we really need... We really need at least one med kit. Um... Yeah. I think it's probably good to bring Tufts in. With a Wait, you know what? We're gonna have to make We're gonna have to make a decision here. Take a nanofiber. Tufts in, you're gonna have the scope. Fields, you will now have a laser rifle. And we're probably going to bring Ragery. Laser rifle. And I'll tell you what, take a nanofiber vest. I don't know what to expect here. All I've heard is that Newfoundland is hell. And so I'm a little bit nervous. But hopefully we find out hell what hell is like together. Because we're heading there next. Thanks, everybody, for the support. Having a super time with Enemy Within. I absolutely love it. There's a whole new layer of things to deal with. And I feel like we're in an okay spot, but then one thing goes wrong, and I feel like we're going to lose everything. And I just I hope that we can survive this. Uh, that'd be real nice. Okay, working hard over here. Hope you guys are enjoying it. We'll see you next time. Bye.